I would say for the first century of Marfan syndrome, we really looked at it as, a, as you say, a weakening of the connective tissue. In fact, we now know that that was uh, off base, that in fact the, uh, the major genetic change in a big protein in the, in the connective tissue doesn't involve strength so much as uh, growth signaling. And by having a change in this protein, the normal uh, molecular signals that tell cells when to move, when to differentiate into other cells, uh, when to actually divide, uh, is um, abnormal. And that uh, most of the features of Marfan syndrome uh, are due to this abnormal signaling, which is really a secondary phenomenon of the change in this protein. Thank <music> you.